I'll tell you. Was he a wife. mugger or something? Yeah, he was robbing. He was a home invader, robbing their home. And they haven't found him yet. So they're talking about how great it is that she. Well, you come in my house, you're dead. In fact, I'll show people on air right now. And people are so scared of firearms. I mean, you come in here hey, trying to kill people, yeah. it's over. Well, you guys we got can a bunch of that here, right? You can carry it. Yeah, in. we got a bunch of guys that are armed back I there. I think it's great. But I mean, what's the big deal? Yeah. I mean, uh, the criminal's going to have a gun anyways. What is that, a 45? This is a 357. Nice. I mean, I only have this because even though I'm a good shot and good with, the, you know, like more complex firearms and semi autos, under stress. Yeah. I mean, with this even short barrel, a medium barrel, I can shoot a man sized target at 7,500 yards. Okay, so somebody comes in here, I'm not missing. Yeah. And and plus, this is pretty much a, a, a high velocity, almost a rifle around. So this is one of the most deadly rounds out there for a handgun. It's do, do much you know better what would than happen if you whip that out in Chicago in a mall, you know, or you had it in your studio. If you were in Mancow studio and you took it out, people would crap their pants. It, but it, if they saw the government with it, they'd be feel safe. Right, right. There's nothing wrong with that. You're, whole, you're an American man. You, you, you have a Foyd car. You, you know, you've done all the things. By the way, you can't get ammo uh, in Chicago. You By the can't. way, we have butcher knives in there. Right, right. Or swimming pools. Kids can draw in swimming pools. Or dive from that. Knives, whatever. This man broke into her house, and he pummeled her. What a tough guy. It was disgusting. I mean, it was just revolting. And my thought was, well, yeah, great, if she would have had a gun, except if it was- Is that it up. right there? Scroll down. Yes. Oh, God. It's terrible. You've, I, it, it is disgusting to see this. And why, why is he doing this to her? He's robbing the home. And worse off, the, uh, her child is watching. And, and if you have a gun, great. But if you have it locked up and you don't have ammo close by, you still can't do anything. This man. Did we post this on Infowars.com? It's unbelievable. And he keeps coming back. This guy is a complete lunatic. And then he throws her down the stairs. She's, you know, here's the miracle of miracles. She's alive. She's alive. Well, this is good Stockholm syndrome. Look, she's groveling. It's unbelievable. And look, the kids are watching. Yeah. Only in America will we put up with this. In England, he'd probably sue her if his fists were hurt, and they 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 would and rule. They would, yeah. I'm not joking. This 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 is unbelievable. It's crazy. Uh, all right, Matt. Thank you so much. 1530WCKG.com.